very carefully is how you should raise them. What do you want them to be? You raise your children for them to become something, right? If you raise chickens, you want them to have meat so you can eat them, correct? If you raise uh, sheep, you want them to give milk and to give the meat. You raise children for what? Ask yourself that question. Why are you raising children? Sincerely. So many will say, I raise children because I want them to be doctors and lawyers. Wrong. Finish. Right from the get-go, you're done. You're raising children to become slaves to this dunya and to become slaves to their ego. What are you raising your children now for? What does she have any teaching us? What is his darga for? He's building a village up here. He says this is for you and your children and your grandchildren. So now to raise our children, we are raising them. Shaykh is teaching us to raise them to become what? To become Abdullah. To become servants to Allah. The same reason we want to be raised the same way that we want to live in this world, the same way that we want to die and to be raised in the hereafter as Abdullah. That is our goal. If you're sincere, don't say, oh yeah, 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 also Abdullah. So many, when I say that, not doctors, yeah, 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 okay, okay, yeah, of course, of course Abdullah, yes. No, it's not, don't lie. If your um, most important thing is for them to be raised to become a servant of Allah, then you're going to find servants of Allah and ask them how to raise my kid. And before that, you're going to find servants of Allah to ask them, teach me how to become a servant of Allah too. And you're going to find a community and a surrounding that is going to support that belief. Because if you have that belief, but you don't have the surrounding and the support system, you will fail. Because this whole world is just going to swallow you, just like that. We are spoiled. We have this. Use it properly. There's no guarantee it's going to stay with us forever. No. Understand what it is that our Shah has left behind that is going to be good for us. And use it properly. And our wish is to raise our children to become first servants to our Shaykh and servants to the Prophet, then to become servants to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That's what we are hoping to do. But when you are raising your children in the way of our Shaykh, don't fight what is uh, being given to you. If you start to fight, then it's not going to benefit you too much. You say, yeah, I love Shaykh Fendi, I believe in your way, but I want to raise my children in another way. It's not going to benefit you too much or your child that way too much. May Allah make it easy, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. Okay. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. I'm a new murid. Can you recommend something to help me increase peace in my 